This video is for parents who would like to check their child's progress in IXL. Teachers are going to have students working in two different sections of the program. The diagnostic section is like a placement test that identifies where your child should be working on different skills and different subjects. The learning section is where they practice and learn new skills based on where they are according to the diagnostic. When your child first clicks into the diagnostic section of the program, you can scroll down to see an overview of your child's progress in each subject and skill. The bar shows you the grade level equivalent. So this child is working between a fifth and sixth grade level in math. And as your child completes more questions, that bar will get smaller and eventually turn into a circle. And the number inside the circle is the grade level equivalent for that child. If you want more detail, click into analytics. Up top here where it says usage details, you're seeing the data for your child's work in the learning section of the program. So either working on teacher recommended skills or program recommended skills. So this time spent is only the time they spent in the learning section, not in the diagnostic section. If you would like more detail, scroll down and you will see some gray bars. You'll have a, a gray bar for each day that your child worked in the program. It will show you how much time. The first chunk of information is about their time spent in the learning section. The second is the time spent in the diagnostic section. So on May 15th, this student completed 10 questions in the recommendations wall and 31 questions in the diagnostic. On May 4th, this child did not work in the learning section of the program at all and just completed two questions in the diagnostic. If you would like even more data on your child's progress in IXL, click on the plus sign at the end of each gray bar. For data about the diagnostic work your child has done, you can click on the See Action Plan link. That will open a report in a new tab. To get back to IXL after you've viewed the report, just X out of the tab. And for more information about your child's work in the learning section of the program, you can use the arrows to see a preview of the questions that your child has been working on. And that's it for checking your child's progress in IXL.